So I, I find it, you know, you're not obviously hungry before you go out to bat, you're a little bit nervous, I suppose. Um, everyone's different, but um, the other guys were pretty quiet during lunchtime, you know, we were pretty focused. We weren't, um, you know, we hadn't given up the ghost at all. Uh, we, we thought if we batted well, we would be able to get, you know, we had a good crack. Um, but guys, guys are guys just focusing on what they had to do and, and go through the normal routines and, and, and just go out there and give it a good crack. Good stroke. Plenty of width and Ryder jumped all over it. That's gone. We needed a good start and we got it. You know, we were sitting off the nun and, and had a good clip too. So, um, you know, at that stage there, there was a lot of belief. That, um, we knew if we batted well and, and picked up those ones and kept that rate at um, you know around about six or seven or even eight you know we'd back ourselves um, because you know I think we, you know you can chase ten and over quite easily on that wicket you know um, or you should be able to um, you know with wickets in hand so I guess the, the plan I was always working to was, was wickets in hand and, and we've got some great hitters down the bottom and, and um, you know uh, you get as close and take it as long as we could and, and and, and um, you know, you can give ourselves a good, good crack at the end. Oh, that's more like it. Crunched into the mid-wicket fence for four. A beauty from now. I suppose you can afford to do those on, on a pretty good wicket. Um, with the field up, I suppose. Uh, but I guess um, it was just watch the ball as hard as you can and, and let things take over from there. Um, but yeah, it probably wasn't pretty at the best of times, but, um, you know, sometimes it, it comes off. It's a lovely shot. Catch it! Good stroke. You don't worry about catch it. Fetch it is the more appropriate fade, uh, phrase. Well, I think um, the, the plan was always uh, for, for me to, to be there at the end and, and, and hopefully, um, you know, obviously pick up those bad balls and, and try and hit them for four as they came, but to try and pick up those ones as regularly as you can and ones and twos, but, um, you know, and, and hopefully some guys can come in and, and and get in quickly and also hit those boundaries as well. But, um, you know, the combination of maybe the execution and, and we didn't get those boundaries and they bowled pretty well. Um, you know, we, I think we let ourselves down a little bit at the end and we didn't get those boundaries that, that, that would have, um, you know, made that job so much more easier. Well, they pushed the two. Jamie Howell, turn and go. He's got a scamper. Will he beat the throw again? I guess it hasn't sunk in yet, you know, the, the, um, you know, the size of the score, or I guess it's overshadowed by the fact that, you know, well, it wasn't enough and, and, and we didn't get over that line, it would have been great to have got the 100 and, 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 won, and won the series in Napier, but, um, you know, it wasn't to be and, and we've picked ourselves up um, mentally as well to, to, to come out strong on, on Saturday. First, um, first one, one day hundred or hundred for New Zealand. It's you always dream about it, and, and um, hopefully next time we'll be on a winning toe.